A prayerful mood in this Petersburg sanctuary. Many feel it's the only way to be, given what the city has seen in 2019. Drastic times call for drastic change. There have been 17 murders in Petersburg this year, tying the most ever in the city of 30,000 people. Most of the victims and suspects are young men. I did one funeral, one, one young man was 24 years old, and he had kids, one, two, three, and four. And the whole time I was preaching the funeral, the four-year-old was standing up at the cast saying, I want my daddy. Rise up and help mentor and father these young men, and I guarantee you the crime rate is going to go down. The passion shown by Selena Doe stems from her son. She says several of his friends have died in street violence. They don't feel love. They have no direction. They're in the streets. So I believe if some real men just step up to the plate and just mentor them, I believe that a lot of the violence in the streets will stop. Petersburg police say they've made arrests in nine of the 17 murders, but more arrests are possible in the other cases if community members shared information with the police. People are fearful of police officers, and it comes from just being black and being raised on not trusting them. December 2015 helped change Renee Dixon's mind. Her boyfriend, Kwan Quarles, was shot and killed. Dixon says she respects the officers on the case, although no arrests have been made. I forgive you, and I just pray that you don't do that to anybody else. Dixon says those who commit violence rarely see what happens on the other end of it. But just think before you do something like that. Just think about people's kids, their moms, the woman that that person loves. 